That's right, we're here with Buzzo now. On map two specifically, you guys absolutely destroyed Echo Fox. Now, you guys typically are not terribly strong on London Docks. You kind of struggle to close out the win. So what do you think changed this time around? Yeah, I don't know. I think that's our problem. We like in general our problem is we have slow we have slow starts and if we have a good start we can't clutch up. But that's what we're sort of improving on um, as our time goes on here. Uh, London Docks, I think we've lost six three and then three six fives to you know rise optic TK. Um, so we've had pretty rough London Docks, but it's one of those things where we're still confident that we can sort of close it out. We just gotta like I said learn to clutch up. Um, we still do similar strats and um yeah it's just clutching up really you guys have improved so much i know we were just chatting about this before the interview and the casters have said it you're probably the most improved team here at the pro league i know you said you didn't know how you've improved but do you have do you have an area in which you feel you've improved the most um what personally or as a team i mean either way both i mean personally i sort of um i felt like i was playing good but uh, as a team, we weren't putting me, I guess, in the right position, so it sort of wasn't my fault, so to speak. But um, after the first week, we sort of, um, you know, sat back and, I guess, talked about how we sort of needed to change everything up. Um, Scrim-wise, we haven't really played too many teams. We played Mox's team a few times online. We played Envy last night and, I think, Vitality, really. So we haven't scrimmed, like, you know, top-tier teams to sort of, like, learn stuff off of but we've sort of just been working on a few small things like i said changing our play style to put me sort of more in the hill to sort of cater to the way um the na and eu teams are playing so we sort of came into this stage sort of playing a bit different to like new orleans and dallas we placed decently not great but um you know we didn't understand that our play style was wrong so we sort of after the first week we changed that up and um it's helped me sort of improve my individual uh, gameplay as well well, it's definitely working. Now, we've got, you've got a couple weeks off to practice. When do we return for the rest of the Division A matches here in Stage 1? What can we expect from Mind Freak? Yeah. Um, I, I don't even know, to be honest. It's going to be rough. I don't know what we want to do, like, because we've had it before. We sort of, um, back when we had Excite in the team, we played really well, and then we came back home and we scrimmed, you know, the APAC teams. And, um, you know, you can sort of try to play the way, you know, the style that we've learned here, but then you just sort of get, a, you get away with just individual skill. You know, you can win games individually, whereas, you know, playing overseas, you really got to focus on the team. You know, it's, a lot, it's, it's about clutching up, but it's about, you know, teamwork as well, whereas back home, you know, we can get away with, you know, doing stupid things. So, yeah, I mean, I, I don't even know. I'm, I'm going to say that, you know, we can sort of keep this going, keep this going. I don't know what we want to do at home, whether we're going to scrim and, just not get mad when we lose, you know, back home and just sort of focus on working on, you know, working on different things and, you know, look at the big picture. Well, thank you for the interview. Congratulations. Very, very well played. Now back to Rich at the desk.